Today's video is brought to us by Aventon. Aventon makes durable, dependable, high-performing e-mobility products that thrill and delight riders over and over again. Aventon manufactures all of their own components versus other competitors who assemble piece by piece from different manufacturers, and Aventon's frames are built to be compatible with most standard bike accessories. It's a superior product at an accessible price point. There's a wide range of models, and Aventon owns and oversees the design and manufacture process from soup to nuts. Now, I love my Aventon e-bike, and my kids do as well. They constantly keep taking it from me. Uh, but if you're interested in your own Aventon e-bike, they're running a special right now for the month of October of 2022. If you buy two e-bikes, they'll give you $250 off using the code here on the screen, buy two, save 250. You can use my link down below to learn more. And as a side note, Aventon is the only e-bike manufacturer that offers discounts for first responders and our military. Thanks to Aventon for sponsoring the video and let's get into today's topic. All right, guys and gals, let's discuss PayPal. Yes, I know PayPal is generally anti-gun, but millions of people use it. And what they did this past couple days here uh, has been called things like uh, Orwellian, insane and the best thing to happen to the adoption of bitcoin and crypto what am i talking about well a couple days ago paypal uh, released their new end user agreement which was supposed to go into effect on november 3rd and in that agreement was something that was kind of odd it's actually in their acceptable use policy and paypal said that they would fine any of their users $2,500 in a list of expanded prohibited activities that included uh, the sending, posting, or publication of any messages, content, or materials that promote misinformation or present a risk to user well-being or safety. PayPal is going to deduct $2,500 from users' balances, and as you can imagine, the world responded. Anyone from Elon Musk to former ownership to uh, former partners, they all came out and said that it was basically against everything that was they ever uh, believed in in starting this, this platform, PayPal. And things like uh, delete PayPal or boycott PayPal started trending across the globe. And their stock dropped 6%. And as you can imagine, PayPal responded. Yes, PayPal has addressed this. They said that this went out in error and that language was never supposed to be uh, in this acceptable use policy and it's not going to go uh, go into effect on November 3rd. It was just an error. Please, please keep using our, our service. Please help us make money. In fact, I'm going to give you their quote. Yesterday, Sunday, a uh, PayPal spokesperson said this and I quote, an AUP notice recently went out in error that included incorrect information. PayPal is not fining people for misinformation, and this language was never intended to be inserted in our policy. Our teams are working to correct our policy pages. We're sorry for the confusion this has caused. Now, <laughs> the acceptable use policies are usually stuff that people scroll through, get to the very end, and you know, click that, I accept, or, or whatever, depending on how it's presented to you. But somebody read through it and caught this, and now PayPal is doing what we call in Louisiana the crawfish. They just keep backing away from this. Wow, what a quick turnaround. Hey, we don't like what you say. We're going to take $2,500 of your money that you have entrusted in us, like an e-bank, an e-savings account, and like a, a slush fund, if you will. We're going to take your money because we don't like what you say. Now, what are you going to do about it? Thousands and thousands of people are deleting PayPal, I'm going to do the same. I am going to cease to use the, the platform uh, because, listen, um, we have rights and we're not going to be told that our rights have no bearing, no standing. They don't have any value by these silly uh, companies that just want to go woke. It's not going to happen. Um, you know, PayPal, if you kind of you stepped in it and like... The old saying is, you go woke, you go broke. And uh, it doesn't. I don't think it's going to matter to many people that you said, oh, ah, it's an error, it wasn't supposed to be there. Do you guys and gals agree? Uh, it's just, uh, it's shocking. But crazy stuff, man. Just another company that's going to step up and think that they can tell us what we can do. Uh, hell no, not going to happen. 
we the people have the power, not you, the private company who wants to just go woke. Let me know what you guys and gals think about it down below. Are you going to stand or continue to use PayPal? Not many people would stand with them after this, but will you continue to use it? Is it something you use regularly to pay bills or what have you? It's, I'm, gonna, I'm not going to lie, it's a convenient feature. It's a very convenient feature. And as somebody who, I don't use the other ones like Venmo and all that stuff, but I guess I got to look into which one of those e-payments uh, I can get that is kind of in line with our rights. If there's any of you all know, let me know down below because I honestly don't know what I'm going to do uh, as far as one of those quick um, e-processing, whatever you want to call them, apps or whatever. Just crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. PayPal, you stepped in it. Guys and gals, I just wanted to get this out there for you because I know a lot of people are talking about it. And I waited, specifically waited, uh, a little bit longer to make it this afternoon's video because I wanted to see what PayPal was going to say. And PayPal has come out saying, oh, it wasn't, well, it wasn't me. We didn't do it. Somebody, somebody else put that language in there and hit send. It wasn't, wasn't us. <laughs> Uh, until we see each other again, be safe, stay vigilant, carry a gun to keep you, your friends, your family, your community safe because that's what it's for and even the payment processing companies don't like it. That's a win. Take care.